Hello and welcome in to another Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets PC custom map discovery on this channel. And today we have a map from a completely new mapper I've never heard of before and his name is Z Positive. And I kind of found this map a bit by accident since he uploaded a trailer for it on his YouTube channel and it was sent to me by one of my viewers. And I thought, hey, might as well try it out. I have to admit, I didn't really expect anything because it's a first map, so I kind of expected it to just be a bunch of cubes in a row and like really short. And also after reading the FAQ where he said it's about a 15 minute map, I was just like, yeah, okay, small map, nothing big. But boy, we were wrong. So as you could tell from this little preview, the map is actually pretty impressive for a first map and it has a bunch of really cool stuff and really nice geometry and room design and I'm super happy that I can show it off to you now on YouTube. Please go and check out Z Positive. he'll be linked in the video description of course. So check out his channel, give him some support on the custom map and now enjoy the playthrough, have fun and thank you so much for watching. Playtime around 15 minutes, okay that's actually not that much, fair enough. There are more than 5 gold cards you can collect and 4 secrets you have to find. What does he mean there are more than 5? Why, why, why do I not get the max amount told? Uh, it's also on the editor. See, good thing we read the readme, now I know. Custom map, new custom map by a new mapper that we've never played anything uh, from. Z positive, I knew that. You haven't played this either? Yeah, I think nobody knows this really, we're completely blind. I have no idea if it's good. I hope it's good. He says it's 15 minutes in the FAQ. And we have four secrets and no music. I mean, to be fair, it looks good, but everything on the new editor kind of looks good. Ooh, Aloha Mora. Okay, let's see. It's giving me HP1 vibes off the bat. That's cool though with those pots. That is some HP1 vibes. I don't, I don't hate it. It's so weird collecting beans again after the meme run. That's a very dark room, by the way. <laughs> I mean, at least there's collectibles in here. Did he forget to put like a light source in this or something? Oh my god, this is just the void. Wait, I saw something. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, wait, he did forget to put light sources in. I saw a door as well. Maybe we are supposed to come back with Lumos or something. I, I can't even find my way out of this. Help. Help. Oh, wait. Dude, I am I'm actually brain dead. There's, there's just a statue here. I don't know how I didn't see that. Well, that was a bit stupid, but that makes sense now. This door is closed. Okay. Ah. Brain deadness level pretty dang high. Okay, this is not a secret, though. Oh, I'll leave that in the video. Don't you worry. Yeah, this is the door I saw, but it seems to be... Also shot, so... Okay, that's kind of cool then, honestly, with the gargoyle. That's a cool mechanic. I don't hate it. This is just a room. Okay. I guess I found everything already without the gargoyle, so... There is a secret here. Uh, but how do we open it? Oh, this looks nice! This looks nice, actually. That's a cool room. Yeah, if I say I don't hate it, it's a pretty big praise, actually. As a German, that, that means a lot. Very true. Oh yeah, Carlotta Pinkstone. Oh, her card still moves in this, let's go. Even in the editor. Ah, okay, the classic old HP1 painting secret. I love the HP1 vibes so much, it's actually good. It's a pretty map, like for their first map, I mean, it's all very... I mean, this room isn't even that blocky, but... I guess geometry-wise, of course, it's, it's a bit simpler, but... Man, it doesn't look bad at all. It doesn't look bad at all. It's pretty. Hmm... That's cool. I kind of want the Lumos down there. There's a couple of untied ends, which I'm not a fan of. Hmm. I don't know, there's definitely- oh, is that just a Lumos? No, I went there with Lumos, right? Yeah, okay. It's not just a Lumos. Hmm. In that case, I have absolutely no idea. But let's continue. Some some senses are tingling for me as well. There's something going on here. Okay. 
Anything here? Oh god. You actually have to be good at the game for this map? Excuse me? Why is it so dark here? Good thing I got Lumos. Uh-huh. Okay. Ooh! He could have really increased the brightness in some of the areas, but... Oh god! <laughs> Jump scare, but apart from that, it's pretty nice. Okay. And pretty straightforward snail room. I, I dig it. Is this game too loud, by the way? It might be a bit... A bit much, if that makes any sense. I'll get all the beams, of course. I always play custom maps kind of max percent. Okay, we still haven't found a single secret. What the fuck? I guess that fits there. Is that a secret? What the fuck? Did he just not activate them? <laughs> I'm confused. It's a good one, though. This looks cool. This looks kind of cool as well. Totally the one I aim for, by the way. What the fuck? Is this one impossible to hit? Okay, so this is just a side corridor. I mean, I do like this. It's a bit claustrophobic. <laughs> so I'm sorry if that's anyone's fear, but... Apart from that, it's kind of, sort of pretty. I'm surprised those don't count as secrets. I kind of expected them to. And it's five gold cards, he said, so... Hmm. Secret triggers are on by default. Ah, so it couldn't have just been an accident, basically, yeah. Yeah, maybe... Maybe maybe it's just not a, supposed to be a secret then, I don't know. Ooh! That's cozy! Oh, wow, well, with the big Hogwarts symbol at the top as well. In the Lockhart paintings, of course. Oh, this is kind of neat. Is, the, is this a secret? Oh, huh, I don't trust that this has to... Fireplace is always secrets. Or I guess... Oh, cool! Oh, that's cool! You cast on it, you get, get Godric Gryffindor. Oh, That's nice. I love the coziness. This map does really look good. Even though I think it's also the new engine a lot. Um... It re oh god, getting crushed. It really does help making the game or make make the game look better, basically more vibrant. I love the lighting in it in that engine. Huh? What the fuck? I mean, at least it goes down. That's kind of nice. I st I'm a bit worried. I'm still on zero secrets. Sometimes you have elevators that don't let you go down again. What am I? Wait, I can't jump on this. <laughs> I'm just I'm undecided what way I want to go. Oh my god. Why does this have so much speed? You wonder if it's set to crush me? We, we test that afterwards because I don't have safe states bound, but... For science I would love to try that. I don't know why we can jump that high, but... I don't think that's how physics work. Okay, this... I don't know if I'm a fan of the lighting in this room. This rem reminds me a little bit of Zasta's first Jump King, but only like design-wise, kind of. I don't know. Maybe I'm just completely off, but... A little bit. Uh, well, I guess we push this. It does a bit, I think. Like, this thing and the room itself just being a thing like this. It's kind of hard to explain. Oh, that's kind of neat as well. <laughs> it's just a random pillar here. I actually did not expect this map to be that fleshed out, I have to admit. Especially if it's like their first map and it's like 15 minutes long according to them, which I don't think I'll beat. Wait, is this gold cards? That's a nice teaser. I doubt it opens at any point. <laughs> it's just the gold card challenge behind it. At least it very much looks like it, yeah. Okay. I feel like there's so many pathways I'm not taking. Man, this looks sick as well. This, this kind of reminds me of something as well. I want to go back real quick, one second. Because I think... Is there anything I haven't been to yet? Oh, no, I don't think so. Okay, we'll go back through the top. Yeah, I guess HP1, like, flippendo vibes a little bit, because this is probably gonna start moving, which means I jump onto this first. Yeah, okay. I mean, this is chill. Oh god, I almost didn't see that. That's a nice secret, I like that. Actually pretty sick. Reminds me of PlayStation 1 loading screens. Okay, that's the first actual secret. No! I I don't think I could have possibly been any faster, to be honest. Yeah, potions, one PC potions, 100%, yeah. PlayStation 1 loading screens I can see as well. It does look like that. Oh my god, it does look like that. 
That's the truth. Why do we have wet? I guess there's water on this. Imagine you would slide on this platform. That would be terrible. Okay, easy. Easy jump. It does look like the PlayStation 1 loading screen now that you say it. I agree. That's cool. The huge flipendo opened this. Yeah, we're playing some custom maps now. We're having fun with that. It's the melted scourge texture. Yeah, but at least it doesn't give us damage, but yeah. I guess the creator put like water on this. This looks very sus, but I think it's probably fine. Man, this is cool as hell. This is a good map. Like, it's actually a good map. Okay, Flipendo. I like it as well. I think it's a bit dark at times, I have to say. I wouldn't I wouldn't have minded if it's like a tiny bit brighter, but but uh, the mood is still really nice in general. Okay, so we got Purple the Fowl. And something opened in the bin the room we came from now. This is kind of a hard jump with the ceiling. I mean not really, but <laughs> it's it's an advanced jump, not really either. Just wanted to check if there's invisible walls over that collision. For science. I like this, by the way. It's a nice alcove. It's actually pretty. It's pretty pretty. My favorite card? Oh, that's a good question. What is my favorite card? I don't think I've ever really settled on that, to be honest. I don't even know myself, apparently. Google. Lumos? Okay, that was a big Lumos. Oh, it's not a secret, but it's a star. Okay. Maybe Ulrich the Oddball, that's a fun card. And you get him from Fred and George. Wait, what the fuck? What is this Lumos platform? There's a card down there, but... Wait, what? Huh? <laughs> yeah, this is cool. I guess it is dungeons time, potions time. I really, I still, I love the vibes of this. This is more like Bicorn vibes now, but... Oh yeah, definitely. Wow. God, almost failed that. I don't think, did we get a safe bug yet? What do I do here? Down there? Ah, okay. Wait, no, huh? This again, I guess? That's kind of a cool puzzle. That's actually a really cool puzzle. It's a trap. Perfect emote, I think. This looks, this soul looks like a trap. It's like in Incredibles. I don't know if people know the scene where you like, it's just a bridge and then at the end there's like traps all on the sides and stuff. I love that movie, by the way. Incredibles is so good. At ah, see? See? I'm not an idiot. I know my traps when I see them. I almost pushed, I wanted to push them off. I didn't even realize there's like, um, those pits behind. It's one of the best scenes in the movies. It's a really good scene. I do agree. I'm glad people remember that scene as well. Okay, this seems like it would close though. Man, I feel like I'm missing out on so much. This looks sick as well. Holy shit, man. This map is nice. Again, it could be a bit brighter at times, but... Man, this is, this is really nice. Also, casual bicorn is amazing. I love casual bicorn as well. That's why I like this part as well. Oh yeah, it does look a bit like glaciers before the ice lights. It does. There's also the water dripping down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Okay, so this is where we came from. There's an obvious crack in this wall. I love those secrets. It's not even a secret. Okay, wow. Gold car though? Nope. I mean, I guess it's very obvious. It's just a big chest. It is a Chungus chest, I guess. I guess we deserve that. That's a massive chest, yeah. Harry Potter is the only context in, when, in which that's okay to say. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, hello. Arachnophobes rejoice. Um, help. Okay, we're fine, I think. Okay, this open. I I will not dare to climb into that. Is that even to be climbed into? Yeah, we're going deeper and deeper. Now we are in the chamber. What the fuck, man? This map is sick. I have to say, I like this. You got enough spiders in the legacy, nope. 
We'll bring back the spider jump scares in this game as well. Okay, there's nothing in here. Man, this is actually really nice. I feel like they got more and more conf confident with the map editor as well. Oh, hey! Oh my god, I got Helga Hufflepuff. I cleaned this room. Okay, so we have six. They said it's six gold cards, so yeah. Yeah, no, if there's a boss fight, then we're so fecked with our health. Wait, I have potions, though. Heh, <laughs> we picked some up. The usual Nick so health, yeah. Okay, this is an interesting version of Chamber. Huh? What the fuck? This looks like we're in some futuristic map all of a sudden. Oh, don't tell me. No, don't tell me it's a maze, please. Usually they're not that amazing. So really, please, please don't. I mean, it's very eerie, I have to admit. Harry to the Future was such a cool map, which also had, like, I think a really horrible underwater segment. I'm a bit worried about a boss fight. More amazing than what HP4 tried, true. That maze is kinda awful. Huh? Where is that? I mean, it's not like I can really go back, right? Oh, was that not the map with the maze and the water? Fair enough. Then it must have been a different one. Two more stars, okay. Is it all the way in the beginning? We had the super speed elevator. Oh yeah, on the other side. Why is there a gnome here? This is such a weird area. <laughs> I mean, I like it. It's cool, but... I hope I didn't need this guy for anything else. I guess he went bowling. Did this open something? Me and the boys at 2 a.m. looking for beans. I was I was thinking maybe it opened like one of those sides, but no, I guess not. And the Gryffindor thing ceiling. Okay, I know. I know what you guys mean, but how the fuck do we get back to that, right? Or is that where this map leads us back to? What the fuck? It gets it, it gets more and more narrow. What the fuck is this? This is against arachnophobes and claustrophobes. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's so cool. And we come back out here. Man, that's sick. Wait. Uh, now we just have to know where the way, where the path opened. I think it was back, right? I was not expecting that to connect back here either. Yeah, it's on the other side. Okay. There is still one thing we need to do here. Uh, which is this. Because this somehow broke. Like, why? Why is this broken? It's so weird. But I'm pretty sure that is not supposed to happen, I won't lie. So I'm just gonna use this to get in here. Ah, oh, there isn't really much there anyways. Happens to you too sometimes. Okay, that is really weird. Okay, I thought there would be like a secret. I can't even make potions. Oh, I can. Never mind. Uh, let's make some infinite potions. Make like three because we can. Cool. No, swimming in HP maps is just always the worst thing. Okay, cool. Then I guess we found everything here. We're still on one secret. They must be hidden, like, incredibly difficult. Bro. And when it goes down, you have, like, zero speed. Um... Okay. Is it Picador? <laughs> this is, like, Stanley Parable. What the fuck? Okay, we can go down, we can go straight, or we can go up. What the hell? I don't know where we go. I guess I'll just go up. Is it close behind me? No. Okay, that's maybe good. Maybe that way we can come back to the other ones. Okay, this seems to be its own little chamber. I'm very confused by this. Let me let me scout a hat, you know? Flip a three-sided coin. I mean, a coin has three sides, right? Heads, tails, and then the, the corner. <laughs> Which is very likely, of course. Wait, huh? This is just a dead end. Amazing. This was my favorite one so far. Okay, this is switches. <gasps> it's the gold cards! We know where that is! That was at the start, so it does open. Oh my god. That's so cool. It's a very long cutscene, but we opened something in the gold cards challenge. A little... I did not have my hands on the keyboard. You cannot do that to me. What the fuck, man? The cutscene was sick. I really liked that one. Yeah, he wanted to get me. The speedrunning refle reflexes. Ah, and this is the down path. Oh, wait, no, it was the down path before as well. Huh? I'm confused. Okay, I guess we're fine. Okay, cool. 
Even before that was caused by hitting the right hand button. It could have been. But I guess we also opened something, so that's what matters. Okay, so that's open. Now we just have to get back. This map, it's, it's like crazy intertwined as well. Like, it's like all areas lead to... Lead into each other and stuff. It's it's really cool. Oh, whoops. Kaizo Potter moment. I still hope one day that gets finished. Humans, Kaizo Potter. Also... I'm sorry, map creator, but I have to find soft looks. No, it doesn't work! Oh, it does work. Hey, let's go. I'm stuck. <laughs> Sorry, it's I'm I'm polishing police. I'm sorry. I have to do this. That's my job That's what I'm there for for custom maps. We're here to find soft locks. That's fine. We have debug mode but Yeah, this is basically I'm, I mean very big HP 3 Lappy Force uh, vibes Okay, cool Okay what does this do? Show me- ah, okay, that opens the middle, which is another flipendo, great. Wait, how do we get back, though? The music stopped. Ah, wait, maybe like this? The Hogwarts crest in all directions? Ah! Oh my god, there's a secret. I've played too many customers. Nice one, though. It's not even a secret, what the hell? It's just a gold card. Man, I like this map. I, 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 I well, there's a fly here, I think. Get out of here. I unironically really like this map. I didn't expect that much. I thought it's just a super short, like, first map that's, like, super basic, but it's actually pretty good. I don't think you can squish yourself, but you can probably soft look again. Yeah, you can definitely soft look again. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> oh, there, maybe, actually. Yeah, you probably could have. Well, it's nice here. We live here now. It's a, it's a nice little cave. I enjoy being here. <laughs> Get out of my bedroom. Man, you're such a comfy bedroom. I'm a bit jealous. Okay, what does this do? Oh, it opens the gold card challenge. Okay, well now you would just have to be smart and actually know where that is. Um, that's actually really, really cool, man. Why is this here? Oh, it's just the statics, okay, lol. So, how many cards do we have? We have 7... 7 11. It's another store, I think it is. And still only three secrets, somehow. I don't know how. Oh, I see, Dennis. I guess life got too busy then. Oh, what the fuck?! No! What the fuck is that?! <laughs> No! <laughs> Why was there a hole in the floor? Who, ma who made that there? <laughs> Are you kidding me? I have to do the entire thing now? Well, at least for the YouTubers, this will be done in an instant, so that's cool. It was always there? Oh my god, I'm just such an idiot then. Oh my god, that's just gonna be so bad. Jumped over it with Lumos. Oh, yeah, I saw it better with Lumos, yeah. Oh my god, it's this entire room? We start with this. It's a bit annoying, but if I don't mess around that much, we should be easily get this. What happens if you do this? Because I know this is like the trap, but... I, I really hope I won't fall into that stupid hole again. I, I genuinely, I did not see. I was not ready for that. That's good, though. If it's all good with you guys. It could be. It could be that one of them is actually the trap button. Uh, I guess I'm missing on some beans now. That's a bit sad. I just wanted to cheese the level. <laughs> Let's get those. I'm not... And no bean is left behind, you know? We don't do that. Can I boost in this game? I think I can. What the fuck is menu centering? <laughs> Great. I'll keep that. <laughs> that's that's good. Chang is fun. Is, that's very nice. I love those features. They're, that's the feature I've been waiting for. <laughs> Perfect. But what does menu centering do? I don't I don't understand that. It's related to white screen. Oh, what the hell is happening to the wall to the right? That makes sense then. Centers hard and menu as assets in white screen. Ah, okay. Why is this jittering? 
Are we back in the PlayStation 1 era? Also, yeah, it would be fun to watch, like, play the actual game with the Chungus fun. It's here, right? Dude, I don't see shit! What the- this is- okay, this is actually not very well designed, I won't lie. That's the first thing I don't- oh. Huh? How did this open? I mean, easy. <laughs> I guess. Does the yellow casting help? Is there like, is there a floor here? I guess there is. Bro, I don't see anything. Also, the particles are sick as well. That's new too, right? Dude. I don't know if there is any Lumas around. I, I don't... This is horrible. I mean, I see the edge, but... No. Now I broke it, are you kidding me? This is so dumb. I'll just fly over next time. That is really dumb. That is- that is actually kind of not very well designed, I won't lie. It's okay. I still like this map, but that part is a bit BS. Okay, we can test Saduk's theory. Oh my god, it is. Okay. What does the left one do then? I wanna act. what the fuck? Oh, okay, never mind. One of them gives beans, that's what it does. Uh, I guess- I don't- I still don't really know how it works, but... Some of them give beans, I don't know, it's weird. Okay, so I still don't know how this opened, I won't lie. Maybe it's the other switch in the secret we just went to? I have no clue. At least we won five out of six. Okay, so... Oh my god, save game 10. Huh? Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna save scum this, I don't care. Too early. That's fine. Now we're gonna die, oh no. Like, how are you supposed to do- this is so bad. Oh, okay, I see the- okay, I can actually see the edge. You can barely see the edge of the carpet. Okay. Still really dumb. Okay, so this is where we came from. Uh, is this door opened by now, maybe, with something we did? No, this is still not open. Okay. Maybe that's the end, to be fair. It could be. With how much this map loops around, which I really like, by the way. I kind of like this backtracking. It's surprisingly okay done. Wait, where was gold cards again? Wait a second, where was that? Was I actually not supposed to go back? Wait, 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 I actually don't think I was supposed to go back. Oh god, we have to do this jump again. Well, good thing we did go back for the secret though, which again, I have no idea how that opened, but we take it. Uh, we need two more though. Yeah, we fell three times for absolutely zero profit. The one that doesn't have the beam, yeah, this one. Okay, so where here? Was it over here? Over here? Yeah, it was. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, if we can finally we see something new after 20 minutes of like reloading. I mean, new. This is gold cards. <laughs> I have seen this challenge before, but it's kind of cool to see this here. Yeah, you really need to draw yourself a physical map to navigate this, really. Okay, this is not gold cards anymore. Oh god, this is big! What does he mean, 15 minutes? This map is giant! Oh, okay. Really cool! What the fuck is that? Is that a giant divination, like, crystal ball? <laughs> That's kind of cool. I like that. Oh, also a staple in custom maps. Is it even a custom map if it doesn't use this owl statue? Oh, what the... And then you have to go back again, and I told you there's a secret there. I knew it. I knew that when I first laid eyes on it. Because the wall looked very sus. This looks cool though, on this little black... ...pedestal? I don't know how you call that. Maybe he meant 50? Yeah, honestly, I, at this point I kinda... ...kinda think the same. The, oh no, we have to go back! Oh no! We're gonna fall into the pit. <laughs> Man, this is really cool though. Okay, there's more here. This is where the secret was. Yeah, I feel like a giant amount of custom maps has the Aldo. This is- <laughs> what the hell is this staircase? <laughs> this looks so weird. 
It's such a like crunched together staircase. What the hell? Okay, I guess. It's like there wasn't too much space for this tower, I guess. Maybe there's something up top. I'm actually kind of curious. Oh, see, I don't get dizzy. Lame spin to the top. Oh, that's the end. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. Not yet. We have still stuff to discover. If that's the end, everything else must be secrets. True. That's a good point. So the one in the beginning and then there's... Wait, huh? We've been here, right? Yeah, okay. Then there's down. Yeah, yeah. This is still such HP1 vibes. I love this floor. Okay. The fuck? Where where are we going? Why is this here? <gasps> Don't tell me that's the door from the other side. Oh my god! Holy shit, that's so cool! Yo, that's actually so cool! It all loops around. Man, this is cool! This is a nice map. I assume we're almost done. I mean, we saw the final star. Ah, and it's the Harry card. It's a secret. Okay, but I only have 8 out of 11. Huh. That kind of worries me a bit. Okay, so we're missing a secret. I don't know where that would be. We know where the end is, so I guess I can actually look for that secret. I don't really feel like there are any loose ends left. Let me see. Maybe we can find it out of bounds. No, that's totally fair. It's still... Oh, this one. No, we've had this. Wait, we haven't. We didn't. Oh my god, how did this open? Wait, how did this open? There's a secret here. Wait, was this open on our way back already? Does anyone know? I might have just not noticed. It might have been back. Uh, it might have been open when we went back. Well, that's the last secret and the last star. Beautiful. And with that, we have everything wrapped up. Uh, now I just have to remember how to get to the end. That was a really, really cool map. I really hope they continue as well. I'm very happy that I covered this now, like, because I don't, I mean, I don't, that was the wrong way. I don't feel like the map got too much attention. Maybe it did, who knows? Maybe there's some other HP gaming community out there that we have no idea about, where it was like a banger, but judging by like the YouTube upload and stuff, not too much. So I'm very happy that we got to cover this, and hopefully, to a degree, that's gonna... Where am I? Oh, here. That's gonna motivate them to play more, maybe. So yeah, if anyone wants to, uh, leave some nice comments on that YouTube video. You know, leave them some nice comments if you want, because it's a cool map. They deserve it. Thank you for all the GG's. Okay, cool. We've done everything. We have finished this entire map. We have uh, gotten every secret, every star. Oh, that one secret is annoying a bit that we didn't get that, but honestly, I don't know if it was open on the way back. I might have just missed it. And there we are. Harry's celebrating. We're celebrating. What a nice map. What a nice map. That was really cool. Almost an hour. I guess 50 minutes was a better estimate than 15. I guess it's 15 if you know where to go everywhere and if you don't, like... Um, looked at everything thoroughly. I mean, honestly, for a first map for this person, wow, really good, really good map. I don't know what I would rate this on a scale of 1 to 10. I mean, it's definitely high, um, too, a bit too dark, and I, I didn't like the hole on the way back, to be honest. I was thinking of like 8.5, but the hole was a minus one, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I, I would say 8 to 9 out of 10 both is like reasonable in that spectrum, so I, I would have instinctively gone for 8.5. Because it was really freaking cool. You didn't have to go into the hole. I mean, that's true, the backtracking wasn't needed, but still, like, the fact there was no lighting there was a bit weird. There were, there were some areas in general um, where the lighting was a bit off. Also, holy shit, <laughs> Henry is getting roasted. Yeah, eight and a half, honestly, for me. For me, it was only the darkness, and then, um... I, I guess... Some, like, little details missing. Like, it's hard to describe, but if you compare it to... Cake's map, for example. Do I have it in here? I do. It has, like, so many, like, small details and little things, which... I always really appreciate in custom maps. This map looked cool, it had cool design, but it uh, it didn't have that quite yet. But that's also understandable because it's their first map. So I think 8.5 is actually perfect.